Hello guys and welcome to colormiguel.com and welcome to my post today on how to brand uh, your local business. Well I suppose it's imperative that all businesses start branding uh, start branding themselves online because at the end of the day um, it's frightening to think actually that 70% of all sorts of products and services are done online so therefore it is absolutely crazy that you're not trying to build your online presence and building your brand online for you and your business. Uh, the first thing I suppose you really want to understand is what is your brand? Your brand is really what represents you and what you represent. It's not just a logo or an image. Uh, therefore, uh, when branding your business, we really want to you really want to think what your business is going to represent and what it's going to reflect and what type or part of the market that you're trying to you're trying to target in and what customers you're trying to capture. Um, an easy way I think to really uh, define your brand is ask yourself a few simple questions like. What is your purpose? What's your brand purpose? Your brand promise and your brand personality. Once you have these things down, you really want to get on to the business of how you're going to, to brand your local business. Well, first and foremost, I would say, guys, um, as, a, as a business, irrespective of whether you're a local business or not, to be quite honest about it, you would want to make sure that you're putting out a uniform message on a regular basis. It ha obviously, it has to be a uniform message uh, because... Um, we don't want you to get, uh, be giving conflicting messages, especially when you're online and you're starting your online marketing campaign. You're going to be using various platforms, and because the reason you're going to use the various platforms is so that you can you can broaden your online marketing net, and therefore you don't want any conflicting messages. You want to keep a uniform message. You want continuity on your marketing campaign, and that's what you have to do. Um, where are we going to brand? Uh, where are we going to start branding or? Uh, Local business, well, at the end of the day, guys, look, if you have a website, if you have a website, um, start engaging, start utilizing, start using. If you don't have a website, get one. Straight away, start. Because, uh, as I said before, our blog or our website is our home online, and it's where, it's our center where everybody else radiates from on our marketing campaign, especially if we're trying to brand our business. We really want to start uh, with our website because we can, uh, pick a theme that reflects our business, reflects us, reflects our brand. We can put our logo or our image or whatever we want on our website, and that's where we start the whole branding process. Now, obviously, we're going to go across different platforms, and if you haven't these platforms set up, I would suggest that you start straight away. The likes of Google+, Plus, Pinterest, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, just to name a few. Um, the thing is, they're, they're quite uh, user-friendly, obviously, because many of you have heard of them all anyway. At, at some stage or another, you mightn't have an account, but set them up, set them up, and, and set them up quick, guys. Because as I say, it's really, really about broadening our online marketing net, so that we can build our brand and expose our brand to potential customers and potential clients. That's what it's all about. Um, when we are branding uh, our products and services, I would say that we also have to get visual. Uh, and what I mean by that, we have to start creating images that reflect our brand. And Pinterest is a great example for that because you can really brand your products and services on uh, your business on Pinterest because it's it's a visual it's a visual platform and it's fantastic. If you haven't seen Pinterest, I would definitely say to you go and check it out and definitely start an account with Pinterest because it really, really, really is um, fantastic for all businesses to uh, to highlight your uh, your to brand your business visually and also. I would say start making videos because at the end of the day, guys, look, videos are the way of the future. Um, it's the reason that uh, people it, it converts traffic uh, better than any other medium. So therefore, you really have to start engaging with video. Uh, some people are, are horrified at the fact of getting in front of the camera, but look, uh, it's not that difficult. And I think the biggest mistake people make actually is they try to aim for, for perfection, and there's no need. There's no need. Look. I'm sure you have cop that I have uh, that I use I suppose a lot <laughs> and I'm trying to get out of it but it's that easy so you will make uh, certain errors like that and you will be saying am and um and don't worry about it just get in front of the the camera and look once you're providing quality information people don't care because at the end of the day they want to see it's a natural person that's speaking it's a genuine person that's speaking about your particular brand and your product and service and that's what you're trying to do you're trying to get out there and create exposure and video uh, undoubtedly is the way to do it guys so really really start start making video um 
I would say, uh, uh, after all that, I would say really, really get down and under start understanding the basics of online marketing. Um, it's not that difficult. You really, really just have to start engaging all the different platforms and utilizing um, the different mediums like uh, your blog, video creation, images, and the different platforms that I already mentioned. Now, I've kept my post really, really quick today because um, I just want you to start getting aware of of uh, how to brand your business online and it is imperative that you keep the uniform message as I say and you really really want to put quality information uh, about your uh, about you and your product and service uh, and brand yourself correctly and start building and managing your brand online and obviously the way you're going to do this is create content on a regular basis but make sure you're, you're putting out that uniform message at all times guys that's that's the big thing here and especially if you're a local business uh, it, it is time well spent to start understanding online marketing because it is the way of the future. Look, traditionally, the other advertising means are going beyond our um, our budget, and equally, they're just not effective anymore. And the thing is, there's uh, I think it's over 2.1 billion internet users at the moment. And obviously, that's going to grow. So it tells you you really, really have to get out there and start with your online presence and building your brand online. So that's it for me to go today, guys. Uh, start. Start straight away. Again, if you don't have uh, your blog or your website, get one. If you need any help in any online marketing, guys, from finding a domain name to setting up that that uh, website or blog or content creation, keyword search engine optimization, everything to do with online marketing, I'm here to help you. All you have to do is get in contact uh, with me. So that's it for me today, guys, and thanks very much for listening to me, Colin McGill, and visiting colinmcgill.com.